Hey, it's Tax Quips time from TaxMama.com. Today, Tax Mama hears from Gail in the Tax Quips forum with a common misconception. She says, Do I have to become a business to write off expenses on my taxes? I make a product for a friend of mine. I buy all the materials, and I do this to help their family business. They pay me for each one I make as they get ordered, and I'm already at $600 this year. They're going to 1099 me at the end of the year. I don't make much of anything in the way of profit by the time I pay for the materials. The problem I see for me is I'll have to pay taxes on this money when I didn't make a profit. Well, Bill Kotchis of the Tax Shack in North Carolina gives Gail the good news. Gail, you won't be paying much in taxes, but you have to decide if you consider this activity a hobby or a business. The IRS treats each one a little bit differently. The hobby income is reported on line 21, form 1040, other income. Make sure you report all the income shown on the 1099 miscellaneous you receive. Even though you're allowed to deduct your expenses from your gross income, the two problems with a hobby are, one, you can only deduct your expenses up to the amount of your income. In other words, you can't have a net loss. If you lose a little on the deal, so what? It's a fun hobby for you, right? And the other problem is the expenses you are able to deduct will appear on Schedule A as miscellaneous itemized deductions. So if you don't itemize, you may not be able to deduct the expenses at all. However, if you're trying to make a profit on this in the long run, you're a business. In this case, if your business expenses are more than your gross income, the IRS will allow you to have a net loss within a reasonable time frame for a couple of years if you clearly run your business as a business. What this means is you may apply the business loss towards other income on your tax return, which effectively reduces the amount of the tax on your entire household income. Rita Lewis, the enrolled agent from Connecticut, adds another interesting tidbit. She says one difference between how you report net income from a hobby or a business is if your hobby has a profit, you don't pay self-employment tax on that profit, only income tax. If your business has a profit, you pay SE tax as well as income tax using Schedule SE on your Form 1040. And remember, you can find answers to all kinds of questions about hobbies and businesses and other tax issues free. Where? Where else? At TaxMama.com.